Today's transportation networks crisscross the entire country and bind us together. But what about the forgotten spaces on the map? The places that our road system has left behind. Highways didn't reshape our states, but they almost carved out a new one, like this lost state. Welcome to Forgotonia, a breakaway state that seceded from Illinois and declared war on the United States. So how did Forgotonia get its name? What's the genesis of that? It all started as a publicity stunt. We're just forgotten by the state and federal government, so we ought to just secede. So they did. In the 1960s, when the interstates came through, they bypassed a sizable chunk of western Illinois. Local roads fell apart. Businesses dried up and residents started moving away. So in 1972, several counties shaped their own state and founded the capital in Fandon, a town so remote it even lost its zip code. The uh, people of Forgottonia have been so forgotten, or at least they feel that they have been so forsaken by their, their political leadership, they decided to appoint their own governor. His name is Neil Gam, and he was the governor of what is a shadow government that was in Illinois. And as governor, what responsibilities do you have in Forgottonia? Actually, my job was pretty much over before it began because uh, the whole idea was we had to form an entity that declared war on the government and then we surrendered. No other countries, no other nations extended a helping hand to you? Not a one. Not even Canada. That was the unkindest cut of all, I think. I would have thought Canada would have helped us some, but they were silent. <laughs> Damn Canadians. <laughs> Neil Gam not only would have my vote as governor if I lived in Forgotonia, I'd run that man for national office. Tell me about where we're standing right now. Well, as near as I can recollect, this is the governor's mansion, and this was by far the finest building in town at the time. Would this have been the guest annex to the governor's I mansion? I bet, yeah. This was where the VIPs would stay, and other, would stay other there. Would stay there. Other states would, yes. would, would, would stay there. Yes. Uh -huh. Without help or recognition, Forgottonia abandoned its independence movement. They did get some improvements, though. Recently, a four-lane freeway was extended through western Illinois. But alas, Fandon is still without its own zip code. Do you remember the zip code that once was no, this I place? You no, forgot. So you've already forgotten I've the already zip code of Forgottonia. Well, I could just barely find my way here this morning. Really? Yeah. So once again, a new form of transportation changed the states on the map. And in one case, it could have created our 51st state. We're a country on the move. From waterways, to railways, to highways. How we get around has changed our map and shaped our history. And the story of transportation is hidden in the shapes of our states.